it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot and I'm here to do the daily vibes for around the 9th keep in mind that the timing is fluid okay so the timing these readings are timeless okay so what do we have for a message today Page of Wands reversed. So this is set back to bad news. <laughs> Let's get this started off right. <laughs> now the Page of Wands in reversed is somebody that is immature, that has a self-image problem, that likes to bring other people down. This is somebody that is uh, a show-off, perhaps. A negative Nelly. Let's get another card, because that could mean something else. It could mean that uh, something isn't coming to fruition, you know? We have a procrastinator of some sort. Ooh, page of pentacles reversed. Interesting, okay? Because these two, these are people, and it's like they're both in reverse. They're both, they're not facing each other. They're going in different directions. We have Aries, Leo, Sagittarius, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Definitely a lack of focus here. There's an imbalance of some sort. I feel like it's two different people. I think we have two different people here that do not see eye to eye. They're both immature. Yeah, both childish. Neither one of these people lack focus. They don't follow through with anything that they say they are going to do. Both of these people. Okay. There's lack of commitment here. And probably foolish behavior. Between both. Both people. Uh, one of them is very feisty. The other one is very stubborn. These two people definitely don't see eye to eye together. They don't see eye to eye with each other, put it that way. It's like they're working against each other. They may be put in, they may be in the same space, but they don't like each other. They they are they're at some sort of I don't know, it feels like war with each other. This could be siblings. This could be friends, uh, could be partners, whoever it is. These people don't act like mature adults. Neither of them, okay? Not interested. Not interested in working together at all. The devil. Ooh. Ooh. So the devil is his addictions. Ego. Both of these people have a very big ego. I get it. I got it. Interesting. Interesting. So we have a fire sign and we have an earth sign that don't work very well together, but they're tied to each other. They have some sort of link. They both have a very big ego. They have a hard time making mis making practical decisions. Both of them do. Because they'd rather just play. Both of these people have problems with reality. Now the devil is anger. They're, now it's right in the middle. These people, are, whoever these people are, they're angry with each other. There's demon. There's demons here. There is some demons. There's something that is, is uh, maybe it's addictions. 
ego for sure ego is causing a separation between these people both of these people have a humongous ego fire and earth It doesn't, ha I just have to let you know, it doesn't have to be, it could be a water sign, could be an air sign. Because we all ha have these elements in our chart. Hmm. <laughs> now this is a very forceful energy. Both of these people try to force their will, you know what I mean? They both think that they know what's best oh page of cups wow i don't know if there's some addictions here or we have this person may be a drinker these this could be siblings uh, partners um there's memories there's nostalgia this is the six of cups we have this person up here that is reminiscing about the past. This person over here um, is very emotional, probably uh, speaks be be because their heart is broken or something like that. Could be dealing with a Pisces. Doesn't have to be. Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Either way, we have some addictions here. And ego is in the middle of something. Ego is the problem. The Page of Cups is emotional. There's news coming. There's, mess there's a message coming. Okay, message, message, message. There's a message that is coming. Okay. It's going to be an emotional message. But with the uh, Page of Wands reversed and the Page of Pentacles reversed, I'm not sure that this is a message that you want to hear. Okay, I don't think it is. I don't. I think it has to do with addictions. Uh, and, you know, I'm wondering if somebody goes overboard because this is an overindulgence. Eight of. Eight of Swords reverse. Now the Eight of Swords reverse is an obstacle being removed. Somebody was confined to a situation, but they are no longer confined. They are free. They're free to go wherever they want. They're free. They're free of this confinement. We have a toxic, unhealthy situation here with this devil. Now, this is coming out of prison, you know. I'm not sure if somebody's been in prison or whatnot. doesn't have to be, but this is jail. could be even a mental jail, mental prison. An obstacle is being removed. This is freedom. Freedom to, you know, this is play. It is play. I feel like we have somebody here that is overindulging in something and I feel like you know it could be end up in it with a dead end I mean that that page of Pentacles reverse a dead end this is a foolish behavior there's lack of common sense here somebody is very unhealthy what is this six of cups death death so we have an ending here now this is this is memories there's going to be some memories that come out because of an ending something is coming to an end because of impulsive behavior there's something going on here now this is a profound change this is a transition it's an ending it's a separation it's a loss where there's a lot of memories that come up. This is memories. So there's going to be a loss here because somebody overdoes it. This is an overindulgence. Somebody could end up going to jail or going to prison for, you know, 
I don't know what's going on. There could be some anger that comes because the devil can bring about anger. Anger because of ego. So I'm not sure what is going on. I don't know if there's going to be a fight or something. Nine of Pentacles reversed. This is unstable, insecure, not happy, lack of abundance, irresponsible. We have somebody here that is irresponsible. And they can't find their discipline. They do not have the discipline to remain stable. And it's like they overindulge in some sort of addiction. reverse the king of swords in reverse is somebody that uh somebody in a position of authority that delivers some factual information challenging information is coming could have something to do with the father so there is some sort of information that is coming this information is coming from somebody that is in a position of authority could be somebody that is in law enforcement even. This guy has some sort of information. He is. It's not the happy news. I don't think it's happy news. There could be some upcoming legal matters. Somebody could end up going to jail. Or prison. That's what I see because I feel like I feel like somebody I mean that devil is instant gratification and ego boost. It's like somebody needs some sort of you know, they need to feed some sort of codependency and they go overboard and uh something happens and it causes an ending because that death card is an ending. It is a major ending. Two of Cups, Two of Cups is a partnership. And we have two people right here. So this is about two people. These people look like they're angry with each other. They look like they have their drinks in their hand. I feel like there's going to be a fight. I And I, I just got to tell you what I, what I got to say. Okay, I feel like there's, there's going to be a fight. The authorities could get called. Something is happening. Um, it's almost like these people tried to get together it's like they tried to get together they thought they were going to have some fun and it goes downhill these are not smiling these people aren't smiling they're not it's like they're fighting with their drinks in their hand and that's what it looks like to me um, there's instability there's insecurity here An obstacle has been removed. Now somebody has the ability to um, what do they have the ability to do anyway? Three of Cups. They have the ability to socialize and have fun. Get together. There's a get together here. I know that there is. There is a get together here. There's partying. There's socializing. There's drinking. I know that there's drinking going on. I feel it. There's drinking or drugs or something. Somebody is, is going to be... Uh, overdoing it by the looks of things I think they're gonna be overdoing it they could end I feel like they could end up with handcuffs on <laughs> okay I feel like somebody could end up with handcuffs on because it's like they're they're overdoing it in the drinking department okay 
And this could even be the cops. Okay, somebody, you know, somebody, what is it, like a wrongful death? Two of Wands. Now this is a spur of the moment decision. Somebody is at a crossroads. They're going to be making a decision. It's going to happen all of a sudden. They can choose to go or they can choose to stay. I think they're choosing to go. They're choosing to go somewhere. And I feel like that devil is just waiting. Because the devil is underneath. The devil is waiting. They're waiting to uh, cause a disaster. I feel like we have a disaster here. Ooh. Oh, judgment on the bottom. I just looked down. So this is karma being held accountable. This is the end of things. Judgment is the end. This is a wake up call. Are you ready to be judged? Somebody is about to make a life changing decision. And this life changing decision is it's huge. It's huge. And responsibility is going to be assigned for somebody's actions. I feel like, I don't know what we have here, but it feels like uh, there's going to be, if we, we have the end of, we definitely have the end with the death and judgment. We have the end of a situation. And you notice we got two hands here. Interesting, two different hands. There's some sort of conversation being had here. There's a conversation being had. Should have stayed, shouldn't have went, shouldn't have went. It's like there's somebody, we have, people are teaming up. It's like they're teaming up to feed some sort of addiction. Somebody is about to be judged for. It's almost what do you call that? Um, yeah, like like wrongful. I don't know if it's a death. It, it could be a death. It's like uh, like a set accessory or involuntary. Involuntary. You know what I'm trying to say. There's drinking and driving here, I believe. I don't need the chariot. I feel like there is. I feel like there is definitely some pending court court issues on the table here. I do. I feel like that somebody's gonna be end up. They could end up in jail, in prison, end up with it, with some legal implications um, because they make a poor judgment call. So I would say that there is something, I mean, judgment is a revelation. Something is going to be revealed. It's the end. Somebody, it's the end of the trial, right? It's time to be assigned responsibility for what you've done. So somebody is going to be assigned responsibility for what they've done. There's go I feel like there's going to be an incident with death and the devil and the judgment card. I feel like there's going to be an incident where somebody ends up in jail or prison or something like that. Okay? That's the way I feel. Because of, you know, something like that. Somebody made a spur of the moment decision. And it definitely had, and they didn't make the decision alone. Two people. It was because we have two here, we have two here, and we have two here. Okay, we have two people, 
two different people here. We got two hands right here. And we got these two people up here. Two people are involved here. This is like a couple of people. And it could be siblings. These two people both have addictions. They're tied to each other for some reason. It's not a good reason with that devil card. It's not a good reason, okay? For codependency reason. It's not healthy. It's not a healthy relationship. They should have left. They should have left, but they didn't. They should have, they should have not gotten involved with each other, but it's almost like they kept going back because of the good memories that they had at one point. Look at where I put this card. Interesting. Now this ending is going to put somebody away. <laughs> Good luck.